my assistant moved, so and we were real busy, so one year I didn't do the newsletter. And it's back when we were doing the quarterly remodel days. And uh, some of the questions that we'd ask was, or you would ask, was um, how many repeat and referral people did you get in the last three months? Mine was nine. What did you do different? The newsletter. It's the only thing I had implemented back, that kind of thing. Well, it got me kind of curious because I hadn't put two and two together up until that point. So I looked at my income for that year that I didn't do it versus the year before. Yeah. It was down $20,000. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm thinking maybe the newsletter is important. Uh, one of my clients got it. I had helped her, helped her mother, but she lives in Coppell, where I live. And uh, I had a listing in Dallas. And she got the newsletter, and she called me up, and she goes, I didn't know you did Dallas. Can you help my sister? So I helped her sister sell her house and buy another one. So that was about 14000 in commission, and it cost was about $225. Hmm. So I think that's a 62 to 1 return. I like that one. I take two to four weeks vacation at least. I typically don't work weekends. Um, I actually have a life. Um, I no longer, before I used to feel guilty. You know, if you took time off, you felt guilty. If you were taking an afternoon off and being with your family or friends, you feel guilty and you want to check your phone all the time. Mm -hmm. And that's no longer a a problem at all. And um, so I would encourage any of you, obviously I believe in the system, and it keeps me focused and keeps me out of trouble, if that's possible. And um, I'd love it. So I Mm -hmm. would encourage anyone to do it.